you're gonna stay because that's what good tortilla towers do. The pressure's on. <laughs> Hi everybody, my name is Angel, and today we're gonna be attempting to break a Guinness World Records title. You may be asking yourself at home, what kind of title are we gonna break today? We're gonna be breaking the world record for the tallest stack of tortillas. We have a ton of tortillas. I'm ready to break a world record. We're joined today by our official adjudicator, and her name is Brittany. Hi, Brittany. Hi, Angel, how are you? I'm doing good. I hope you're ready for an experience you've never had before while working. <laughs> I'm certainly excited to see. My name is Brittany Dunn. I'm happy to be here today as a representative from Guinness World Records, the global authority on record breaking. Guinness World Records has offices all over the world. Every week we have over 1,000 record attempt applications globally. As with all of our records, each one of them has its own unique set of guidelines that must be followed. For this Guinness World Records title, the tallest stack of tortillas, we have a unique set of guidelines that I will read for you right now. This record is based on the height of the stack of tortillas achieved. However, you must provide the number of tortillas used. The tortillas should be stacked one on top of the other in a single column. The stack of tortillas must be completely freestanding. No adhesives or internal support are allowed and they must not be attached to each other in any way. If the stack of tortillas topples over at any time, the record attempt comes to an end. The stack of tortillas must stand for at least five seconds after the final tortilla is in place. This has to be accurately timed and it must be measured immediately. So Angel, are you ready? I'm ready. The current record is 76.5 centimeters for the stack of tortillas. Just for reference, this tape marks the tallest stack of tortillas that's ever been stacked, and we're gonna be breaking it today. We're probably not even gonna have enough ruler, TBH. Three, two, one, go. Awesome. <laughs> okay, so I have a little bit of a strategy to this. Really, you wanna make sure the tortillas are as like uniform as humanly possible because they're always in like like little rigid shapes, and you wanna just make sure that like they're just as flat as humanly possible because you don't want them to like start making the tower sway. Uh, that's the strat here, it's a pro strat. Cause like every tortilla is unique, okay? Every tortilla has its own feelings and experiences. This is the part that's like, now 500 of these later, we're going to set a Guinness world record title. I already see that like some of them are bigger than others. And that is one Tortilla stack down. Y'all know I'm gonna eat these, okay? You think I'm not gonna eat tortillas for the next two years of my life? You gotta really like massage your tortillas, you know what I'm saying? Like massage them like you would maybe like a significant other. I don't know what that's like, um, cause I don't have one. But for those of you at home who aren't lonely and sad, so another issue you may run into when doing this, cause I'm a pro tortilla stacker, is you wanna make sure that when you pull off the tortilla, that it doesn't like rip on the bottom. You know sometimes when you separate tortillas, like it rips a little bit. You don't want that. No. See, actually no. I'm starting to feel bad rejecting tortillas like that I don't think are up to like the standard of what I need for my tower. I'm just a boy with a dream stacking tortillas in a tower. Honestly, I'll probably add this to my bio on dating apps afterwards. Like, on my bio, it will say Guinness World Records title holder. <laughs> I'm trying to think of world records you wouldn't want on like a dating <laughs> Oh, longest fingernails, I saw that one. No, I'm not trying to world records title shame people, but um, that is concerning. Let's do a walk around the park. All right, I got my steps in today. Thank you so much. This is our rejection pile, by the way. These are the tortillas that did not make the cut. It doesn't say anything about them. It says more that, you know, I'm just looking for something different right now. <laughs> the 
that's so much louder than I thought it was. He's walking up to someone and you're like, I remember when I was little, uh, my mom used to buy me the Guinness Book of World Records. I like always wanted to be in one of those books because I always felt like, I'm like, there was always like really cool records, like fastest person. You know, you think about it and like animals have world records because like the cheetah is like the fastest mammal. And do you think the cheetah knows it's the fastest mammal? No, it does not. Like they're aspiring to greatness without even knowing it. That's kind of iconic. So if it's re leaning to the right, much like Jenga, I'm gonna put it on the left. <laughs> so it can like kind of bounce its way. I don't know if that's the proper physics for this, but I'm not a scientist. I'm a Latino boy who majored in theater in, <laughs> in college. So um, I have no concept of math. Well, because it's leaning already, if we keep doing that, eventually the, act, like, the gravity is gonna pull it down that way. So you have to kind of compensate by putting it on the opposite side, right? Oh my gosh, it's literally about to fall. No, I'm not, I'm not done. It's absolutely moving. Do you see this? We need to just go at an accelerated pace. I'm, that's my theory. We just need to go faster. him Gomez. Um, Gomez is the final tortilla, regardless. I'd rather lose than not put Gomez on top. Just know, I'm willing to risk it all for Gomez. You gotta risk it to the biscuit. <laughs> We're gonna expedite this process. <sighs> Just you wait. <laughs> And when I get this world record on the first attempt, <laughs> I better, I better hear the praise in the comments. <laughs> That's what I'm waiting on. <laughs> no, no, no. I have patience. I can be here for a couple hours trying to balance this thing for five seconds. Y'all don't know me. When did this become so stressful? I was like, well, like, you know, all the energy and then now I'm like, my anxiety just went through the roof. <laughs> Talk to me. What's wrong? You're gonna be okay, okay? I shouldn't have did that. I shook it. I was like, <laughs> let's keep going. Gomez, I'm so sorry I forgot about you. Hit it. No, no. How many seconds was that? Come on! <laughs> I need to put my forehead on it. Is that allowed? <laughs> I need everyone not to say ooh every time it's about to follow. It's stressing me out and I'm gonna freak out. <laughs> Hit it. <laughs> Thank you. Brittany, this is what I would do to you if it wasn't a pandemic. We've just witnessed the Guinness World Records attempt for the tallest stack of tortillas. This record required a lot of patience, skill, dexterity, concentration, and effort. I can confirm that all the evidence has been received and I'm in a position to make an announcement. So the record to beat is 76.5 centimeters. The current result of this record attempt, 79.0 centimeters, which makes this a brand new Guinness World Records achievement. Congratulations. You are officially amazing. Brittany, I want to thank you so much. This was so much fun. I, I literally was so scared the entire time. Like my anxiety is through the roof. My arthritis is acting up and I think I need a new spine after this. Well, you deserve a break after after this. You work really hard and you were very entertaining the entire time, I must say. <laughs>
Thank you, thank you. I have a newfound respect for tortillas in a way I didn't think I ever would. What else records y'all got? Well, we have over 40,000 records on our database. So you're gonna have to spend an afternoon, maybe while you're eating some of your tortillas, surfing our website and seeing what you can um, attempt next. I love her so much. <laughs> Thank you all so much for watching my attempt. And uh, I am proud to say I'm a Guinness World Records holder. And you are officially amazing. And I'm officially amazing. Follow like.